Welcome to True Projects. In this video, we are going to explain about a project titled Intelligent Video Surveillance using Deep Learning. The introduction of this project is to utilize the deep learning techniques, specifically the Spatial Temporal Autoencoder model for intelligent video surveillance. The project focuses on training the STAVE model on normal walking video frames to enable the detection of abnormal behavior in surveillance videos. By analyzing these patterns and comparing the event with the test frames using the Euclidean distance, the system can identify the deviation from the normal behavior and generate the alerts when the detected behavior exceeds the predefined threshold. The objective of this project is to create an advanced video surveillance system that utilizes the deep learning technique, specifically the STAY model, to effectively detect abnormal behavior in surveillance videos. By training the model on normal walking video frames, the system aims to identify the deviation from typical behavior by analyzing the STAY patterns and comparing the event with test frames using Euclidean distance. This intelligence surveillance system will enhance the security measure by accurately detecting the potential security threats or unusual activities in real time. These are the basic requirements that are needed to build this project. Hardware requirements, operating system as Windows, processor of i5 and above, RAM of 4 GB and above, hard disk of 20 GB and above, software requirement, Python IDE with version of 3.7. These are the modules that are developed to build this project. The first module is Upload Video Frame Dataset. In this module, the user can upload a dataset containing video frames to the application. The dataset include a collection of video frames captured from surveillance footage or any other relevant source. In the second module is Dataset Preprocessing. In this module, the application processes the uploaded video frames. Each frame is read and the pixel values are extracted. The pixel values are then normalized to ensure the consistency and facilitate the accurate analysis. The normalization process typically involves scanning the pixel values between the 0 and 1. In the third module is train spatial temporal autoencoder model. In this module, the application trains the model and the STAY model is the deep learning model specifically designed for analyzing the video data. The pre-processed video frames are fed into the STAY model for training. The model learns to capture the spatial and temporal patterns in the video frames enabling it to detect the abnormal behavior. And the fourth module is of test video surveillance. In this module, the application allows the user to test the video surveillance capabilities of the system. The user can upload a test image or a series of video frames for analysis. The frames are processed individually using the trinet stay model. The model predicts the event or behavior captured in the frames. The predicted event are then compared with the test frames using the Euclidean distance. If the distance exceeds a predefined threshold for normal behavior, the application generates an alert email message indicating the presence of abnormal behavior in the surveillance video. The execution of the project. To execute the project, first we need to open the code folder. This is the code folder consisting of different files. The first folder is dataset folder consisting of various images within it, various videos within it and the model folder consisting of hy files and npy files. Here these hy files contains the learning algorithm information. These files can be loaded into the project code during the runtime to utilize the trained model for various tasks such as making the predictions on new data or performing the specific operation and the test videos folder consisting of different videos and the main text and text one or the python code file and this is the run.bat file instead of executing the program in command line interface we created the windows bat file to execute the project now to run the project double click on run.bat file
This is the graphical user interface. With this, we are interacting with the program. First, we need to click on Upload Video Frames Dataset. And this, we are going to import the dataset from the corresponding folder and click on Dataset folder and select the and click on Select Folder button. Here we get a screen of dataset is loaded and click on data pre-processing button. By this the data is pre-processed and we get an sample image whether the dataset is currently loaded or not done. And then click on giving the total images found in the dataset is of 227 and click on try and spatial temporal auto encoder model button. By this, the model is generated and saved inside of model folder and then click on test video surveillance button. Here it is redirected to the test videos folder and we need to select any one of the video from this folder and I am selecting of this folder of this video and click on open button. Here it detected as abnormal event. The implementation of this intelligent video surveillance system using the state deep learning model has shown promising result in detecting the abnormal behavior. By analyzing the stay patterns and comparing the event with the test frames, the system effectively identifies the deviation from the normal behavior. This project contributes to enhancing the security and surveillance by providing the real-time alerts for potential security threats or unusual activities, improving the overall safety and monitoring capabilities. Thank you for watching video. For more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in For updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.